Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Tiffany and today's video is my rolling makeup use up update number four. Now excuse if you hear any noise in the background like there's a party going on because there is a party going on. My neighbors are having a party. So if you hear that, I don't know if you would hear that, but if you do, excuse that. I'm sorry. Before we get on to the video, I do upload every Monday and Friday with bonus videos on Wednesdays. Also, right now I am having a giveaway going on until June 29th. So please, I'll have that link down below. So check that out. Check me out on Instagram at Tatted Tiffany, where I post life updates, fitness updates, makeup updates. So if you like that, go check that out. So with this rolling makeup use up, I do choose five products to use up completely and uh, roll in other products once I have finished something. So I actually end up finished three products this month. So the first product I did use up is this Rimmel London Stay Matte in Sandstorm. As you can see, it's completely clean except for like the little, you know, staining that tends to happen. I do really enjoy this product, so I have repurchased it many times. It does mattify my skin and I am very oily, so you know, kind of need that. <laughs> So the second product I did finish up was this Benefit Give Me Brow. I'm not sure if it has even a color on it or anything. It's lighter than what I normally wear, but if I brushed it in with the powder that I used to set my eyebrows, it was fine. And as you can see, it started to get very um, goopy and just hard to work with. So I called it quits. I really did enjoy this while I had it but I might just try the essence gimme brow and see how that is comparable because I do hear that's a dupe but I did enjoy this while I had it the third product I did finish up was this dandelion shy bee from benefit it's another deluxe size sample and it's just like a liquid highlighter and that's what it looks like so I don't know why this was supposed to highlight it was more just like a peach cream or concealer so I tended to use this um, under my eyes to brighten it which it did so I enjoyed it for that it didn't give you any coverage or anything like that but uh, it did highlight under the eyes um, I did like it for that so moving on to the things I did not finish I had this Alme single shade in smoke and if I had waited to film this video just like a few more days or like a week or something it would totally be done and this is actually all I have left in it. And as you can see, there's not a lot left. And it's all crumb. It's a crumbly mess. Probably by the time you do are watching this, this will be done. And you'll see these in my next empty. Last product. I'm sure you're not surprised that it's still in this um, project. It was pretty much here from the start. And it seems like it'll be here till I'm like the year end, honestly. <laughs> And this is my When Wild color icon in Mellow Wine. And that is what it looks like right now. Look how it's, it's staying on by the sticker, guys. Staying on by the sticker. And this is what the product looks like now. And as you can see, there's a difference between this. And everything is starting to thin out. But I haven't even, like, touched this corner. So I know it's going to take me a few more months still to finish this up. And this thing is so pigmented that it doesn't take a lot to use it. But it is powdery, though, when you do start dipping your brush into it. But I know it's going to still take me forever to use up. So those are the two products that are getting continued on into this project. Now I'm going to show you the three products I am rolling in to replace the three I finished. So the first thing I am rolling into this project is this Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless in 130 Buff Beige. And as you can see, that is what it looks like now. Quite got considerable pan in this. So hopefully within a month or two, it'll be done. The next product I am rolling in is this Alme, and it's the Alme Smart Shade Butter Kiss Lipstick. I really 
enjoy this product honestly it's so convenient to have in this form and it's just a couple swipes and I'm done and this is all I have left on it and as you can see I'll probably get through it if I just keep it in my purse if I just you know if I keep it in my purse and continue to use it after I eat or whatever this will definitely be done I think within this month it should be done because I really do enjoy it it gets a light it gives me a light sheer wash of color really easy not sticky anything like that so I really do enjoy this and I'll be uh, kind of sad kind of not because I have a lot of the products but I really do enjoy this so I'm rolling this in to finish up the next product I am rolling in to finish up is another lip product and this is the Sephora lip cream I really do enjoy this I think I got the recommendations from Lisa Stevens and she really do enjoy these and I can see why they're very creamy is what I have on now except for the center which is something a little different but very creamy very pigmented doesn't my doesn't move or anything it's not transfer proof it's a lip like cream so it's not like a matte liquid lipstick but it is a very nice and I think that I'm not sure even if it says a shade I really do enjoy this shade it is this one on the lips right now so I have been working on this out of projects because it's like oh look I've been using a whole bunch and I thought it was almost done until you know I took the stopper out and there's so much product in that hopefully I'll get this done within this month and roll out another lip product out of my collection but if you haven't tried it I would say definitely pick up the little sampler kit that they have now that's gonna be it for this update I hope you guys did enjoy it I thank you guys for clicking on and watching this video like I said before I do upload every Monday and Friday with bonus videos on Wednesdays and I do have a giveaway open so I'll have that link down below check that out please subscribe it is for my subscribers and then like the video if you enjoy rolling makeup use ups project panning so I think that's it and I'll see you guys next time bye